In Godot, new groups can be used to organize your scene tree. A group contains a set of nodes, which makes it easy to operate on these nodes at once. For example, this is a scene tree that contains a number of circles. We can create a group called circles and assign all the circle nodes to that group. This way we can access all the circle nodes and we can delete them quite easily. There are two ways to add a node to a group, through the UI or through the code. One way to use groups through the UI is to first select the node that you want to add to a group. In our case, we will add the root node of the circle scene. Then, type the name of the group you want the node to be in. This can be done in the group section in the inspector panel. And just like that, we have added the root node of the circle scene into the circles group. The cool thing is, if you add a node in a scene to a group, then instances of the scene will also add this node to the same group. In our case, we added the root node of the circle scene into the circles group. As a result, all instances of this scene will also have the root node added to the circles group. To add a node into a group through code, use the add to group method. For example, here we use add to group to add the root of the circle scene into the circles group. One of the benefits of node groups is that it can be used to invoke a function on all nodes in that group. For example, to remove all the circles from the scene, we can invoke q3 on each node in the circles group using the call group method. This will cause all the circles to be deleted from the scene. That's all for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.